Hey guys, Google on the way back. I'm Aaron. Eric. And we are here with Community, Community. where last time we dealt with uh, Carnies. Wait, did we ever find out that answer yet? We did not. Damn. Wow. We are try struggling to catch up because we were away from London and people were sick and that's why Calvin's not here. But he's seen this already. Yeah. So fuck him. He would know, oh, probably. Would he? Yeah. He probably lived with the Carnies. Yeah. Like that's how he learned to juggle knives and swallow glass. No wonder his stomach's always fucked up. Yeah. Kingdom phylum class. Order family genus species. I use a mnemonic device. Who? Kevin, please come over for gay sex. <laughs> Why wouldn't you use Karen? Because it's gay sex, dummy. So use great. Now I can't remember anything. Thanks. Why don't we always end up in this position while we're trying to spend a day ransom? Ah, the duala. D. What the heck? It's like a two face thing going on. I'm dressed this way because I have good news and bad news. <laughs> Got to be kidding me. The Which side is the good news? Professor Kane has the flu. He's a good looking the lady. The good news is biology class is He's a good looking cancer. dude. <laughs> three hour lunch? Three hours. I could watch the first half of three movies. Damn it, Calvin. Dreamatorium. Word. Yeah. Study. But I want to. Abed, don't you think today's the perfect day for it? No. Hmm. Abed? Is this a social cue? <laughs> <laughs> I think I went too far with this one. I have to go to the bank today. <laughs> what am I supposed to tell people in line? I had good news and bad news. <laughs> Come on, Craig. Get your life together. <laughs> <laughs> I love him so much. His walk was so great. The outfit's like sewn together yeah, too and so stuff. Good. Oh, man, he's so talented. I have to go to the bank today. <laughs> bank today. What am I gonna tell? Good news and bad news. Putting on the Ritz stick. So he did that just to tell them yeah. good news and bad news? Yeah, he cares, man. How about the, uh, the air conditioning people? True. We do have that. <gasps> space! Oh. Space We're in the dreamatorium. Boy, governor! Quantum spammer up and out a minute! <laughs> the blowguns might intercept... I like the way their outfits turn. How do you know Troy and Britta pairing up wouldn't destroy everything? I run the scenarios. I examine this stuff from every conceivable angle. Use the dreamatorium. You think this is just a room where Troy and I play dinosaurs versus riverboat gamblers together? I want to watch. That sounds cool. I don't usually support lunch because it's unfair to breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid your food won't be ready for another half hour. I'm too busy misunderstanding the whole point of <gasps> Die Hard. <laughs> <laughs> the secret closet science room. This is the dreamatorium's engine. Oh, hmm. It seems kind of crazy. It's like an episode of Doctor Who. Checking in on Abed, making sure he's okay. <laughs> what? He's fine. It's forever. I don't want you to break his brain. Bye, Troy. <clears throat> uh oh, you're gonna break his brain. Mm -hmm. And another thing I hate about Die Hard. God damn it! FBI agents named Johnson. Why? Guy. Why is that what? No tip. You know what would make your scenarios a lot more realistic? Oh, don't destroy anything. We lower functioning brains call this empathy. Uh oh, she's gonna break his brain. You broke him. Oh my god, I broke Abed. Yeah. Yeah. I should have left his cardboard tissue stuff alone. I know. Hello, Annie. Oh no. He's doing what she said to do. What was I doing on the floor? Were we doing it? Is he Jeff? He's Jeff, isn't he? You're really going on with the visual effects in this one, huh? Someone learned After Effects. <laughs> I left my wife for you and she was pregnant. Who do you think inseminated her? <gasps> Now tell me what? what? Oh my god, there's so much drama. Now we're going to kiss. Through so many layers. I didn't get inception. <gasps> I didn't get inception. <laughs> You're out of your bed again. Because I think I'm on a train. Oh! <laughs> because I think I'm on a train. Abed's been filtered out because nobody needs him. Mmm. I need him. Well, you're not simulated. No, but this is. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this is a private compartment. Jeff, get the files. <laughs> He's on a train. Why me? Because you can see the cabinets, and I'll make love to you. Jackpot. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff would. Jeff would do that. There is an Abed in this hospital school, but he's not a doctor. He's a patient. Well, you should probably run in place and let the hallway move around you. <laughs> Maybe Leonard is watching from the 
Bush isn't too about any of that. I don't have cable. <laughs> <laughs> I hate whoever you are. You should probably storm off in. <laughs> she's ran into the wall. Yeah. I'm, I'm not sure what she sees. I think that I'm he's so getting, confused. he's gotten to her. Oh no. Now he's Annie and she's yeah. Annie. I probably shouldn't say things like Star Wars, Zardoz, Cougar Town. Cool, cool, cool. Stop it. Pop cool, culture, cool, pop culture. Cool. I'm on a TV show. You're gonna get in trouble. I'm on a TV show. You're gonna get in trouble. Meta, oh, meta. No. meta. <laughs> I find you guilty of being Ovid. You're under arrest. Can I just interject and say I don't know what the hell's going on? <laughs> <gasps> Contains Abed. <sighs> I'll make it into Sundance, Slam Dance, or Dance Pants. Joint Vents Dance Pants in 2019. Don't tell him. He needs to stumble onto it. And you, you don't get dance, dance Pants. Dance Pants. Look at 2001. Did we have a space odyssey? No. We got snowboarding in the Olympics and we overvalidated Carson Daly. <clears throat> we both need to get more comfortable winging it. At least it'll be less work. I wing down my dreamatorium time by 18 hours a week. I could take up yoga. 18 yeah. hours a week. Long time. Set the tachyon drive to hyper jump. We must get to the other side of this star field before the blowguns intercept. <laughs> Rex, I got way better. Inspector, we're too late. Oh no! Blowguns! <laughs> Look at those things. You'll blow on me for this later. Oh, 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 thank you. Oh, 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 oh my God, Abed! I'm so sorry. No, no, you're committing. This is good stuff. <laughs> Fast food place worth the drive, Shirley? D don't they have study today now? Oh yep. I almost sat on my balls. <laughs> At the last second, made an adjustment. Sorry I bailed on the dreamatorium. It's okay. <sighs> Annie did pretty good in a pinch. <laughs> the people at the bank loved my outfit and they had all kinds of questions about it. I gotta go. I'm telling everybody. All right, well, it's been a good day for everyone. Okay, I didn't really avoid sitting. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. Right oh, on. no. Oh, no. Oh, I'm so sorry. Hurt like hell. I saw eagles. I saw eagles. <laughs> eagles. I saw eagles. Troy and I met in the morning. But you don't have enough chairs. You can bring out pillows from your bedroom and use them on the floor for a Moroccan feel. Ooh, a taste of the Orient. Ooh. Actually, boys, I have a little surprise for you. Bedroom makeover! <laughs> it's okay, buddy. We can put it back. We can put it back the way it was. It's okay. It's okay. Hi, Garrett. I'm sorry. <laughs> 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 the technical difficulties we're working on. Garrett's the film. He films. Huh. Is Garrett the one guy? Yep. He is. Uh, I can't do that with well conforming my face to it. Conforming your face to it. Yeah. I have to be like, ah you know to do that. Like I don't, I don't know if I can keep my face. Well, well yeah, you gotta what, what? How would you go ah without going ah? <laughs> ah You still you still hold me around. Well, Choke, what's doing? Is uh, it like a sure, like throwing your voice like in a class we can take? Ventriloquist class or a YouTube video I can watch? Yeah, I how do they do that? How do they make it sound like their mouth isn't open? Practice or mouth is open, but it's not. I watched a I think it was like a TikTok that was a ventriloquist, and it was like one one week with the puppet. It's like, hey guys, how's it going? Yeah, it's like two weeks with the puppet. It's like, hey guys, yeah. how's it going? It was a little bit better. Yeah, like three weeks with the puppet. Hey guys, he starts talking, like, and his mouth's not moving at all. He's like, he's like shut up over there. We're gonna rob the bank. <laughs> like, he's like, he comes back again. He's like all bruised with the puppets, like, leading him and controlling him now. I was like, holy shit, I ain't taking Ventura. I've seen one like that, but it was watching Supernatural. Did you see that? <laughs> no. And the guy just slowly gets more and more, like, redneck in his, in his, like, dress and deeper as he, you know, he's like, ah, oh, week one, watch Supernatural. Week two, watch Supernatural. Week three, watch Supernatural. Sammy! Sammy! <laughs> he gets more and more, like, Carhartt and flannel. Mm, it's funny. <laughs> it's really fun. Community, though. I like this episode. I always like Abed episodes. They're probably my favorite episodes. Yeah, I know. I like, uh, <laughs> I read my one note at uh -huh. the top, which was just how... <laughs> Pierce remembers his, uh, I forget what they were doing, biology, right? It was like the family his, groups, uh, the no, kingdom no, groups, no, no, all that mnemonic. stuff, right? Like kingdom, what is it? Kingdom, phylum, whatever, species, family, I forget what they're all on. Yeah. But it was, Kevin, please come over for gay sex. 
He was like, I don't remember that one. Why didn't you? Why didn't you make it Karen? It's like because it's gay sex. Gay sex. <laughs> it's like why didn't you say great? Right now I can't remember. He's <laughs> <laughs> just cracking up so much. I just love that. Yeah, you can really tell that they write around Chevy Chase. Either they don't want to be around him, or he doesn't want to be around them. But the stuff they they do. He's like, we didn't get to see anything that he did. He just no. comes in and he's like, what he said exactly? He's like, almost sat on my balls at the last second I made an adjustment. You know, like, yeah. that's what they have that character doing yeah. because of the Chevy Chase thing. And then going, I didn't make an adjustment. Oh, like hell. It was too late. <laughs> I saw eagles. But yeah, no, he wasn't around very much. He, he showed up in the dreamatorium a little yeah. bit. And he's like, I gotta be honest, I have no idea what's going on. That's here. every episode. <laughs> it is. But like, just getting the little taste of like, what are they gonna do? What are they gonna write to explain what he's been doing? I don't know. Yeah. Sat on his balls. So for three <laughs> hours, he went, he sat on his balls, and he hurt like hell, and then he yeah. came back. I can just imagine writers and the writers being like, what do old people do? What are their problems? And he probably sits on his own balls. Now they will hang low. Ugh. That would be terrible. I can't imagine that. I never sat on my own balls. No. I feel like I'm pretty good at, like, adjusting. I think I've had them, like, in between my legs at a yeah. point where I've, ah, ooh, dang, that hurt, you sure. know? But I only ever been like, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Trying to just, like, crack. Sometimes you got to use that one maneuver. It's, I don't know how exactly to describe it. It's, it's like twisting your hips in different directions. It's like whenever you have a wedgie and you do that one, like, step, like, and you get rid of it. I can do that, but I can adjust my own balls. A step for yeah, a wedgie? It's like a step. Yeah, it's like a, like if this is you just walking normally, right? And this, is, this is how I walk. If you have a wedgie, you're walking, you can just be like, get it out. Yeah. I can do that with my balls. You can do that with your balls? Yep. Not, instead of your legs? Yeah. Individually, too. What? <laughs> I just need to move one. One ball. <laughs> I just always remember the, uh, the in the pocket method of like trying to like rearrange things. Mm-hmm. He's like, I don't want to be too obvious. But, like you do too much, like people can see your hand in your pocket and move it around like this. Oh, you know, I mean like going down. And, I can't. My pocket's not deep enough to get to your balls. I can't do it. Your pocket's too high. You gotta just adjust a little bit. I remember how to do that. So Back in like high school and stuff like that. Gonna, I can't get to it. Or like, ah, damn it. Or like it, it gets pushed the wrong way. So you gotta like try to like readjust this. You gotta like try to pull it back up. But you can't take too yeah. long doing it, or it's obvious. Yeah. It's probably obvious if you take too little doing it, too, but... I don't know. Well, that's the Pierce part of the conversation. Sure. I had another thing, but it's not really the balls, so I don't want to go further. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it, what is it? M- m- mono- monogamy? No. Monotony. Nunomic n- device? Monomic device? How do you say it? The n- thing where you... Mnemonic? You know? Like, my mother... Mnemonic? Mnemonic. A mnemonic device? That's what it is? Okay, gotcha. I think that's what he said. I don't know if that's right. The only one I know is the one for planets and doesn't count anymore because Pluto's not a planet anymore. Please excuse my dear Aunt Martha. I don't know what that one is. It's for math. Oh. Parentheses, exponents, um, oh. please excuse my multiplication. The order division. in which you do things yeah. in an equation. Yeah. I just knew it. The or- <laughs> order of operations is what they call it. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Okay. <clears throat> I remember that. Yeah. Uh, there was something for... I don't know. I've, I've heard of different ones. I'm trying to remember which ones I remember from school. but you know, A lot of people were upset when Pluto was demoted as a planet because that specific thing no longer worked anymore. Because what does the mother eat or whatever now? But what, if, What's we, it supposed to be? Huh? What's it supposed to be? My very... I don't remember it at this point. Damn it, Eric. My very energetic mother... <sighs> Do you remember? <laughs> no. This is your story. Yeah. I well, gave you mine. It's useless now, so I don't remember it anymore. I had to make room, Aaron, for uh, fucking, you know, I need to but know. you could just remember it and then remove the P. What were you going to replace it with? Nothing, but you still remember it. My very energetic mother just... Oh, I didn't spell that in monomic, right, or whatever. I hope, I'm just going to rely on autocorrect N-E. on that one. It's N-E. Uh, my right. very N-E. easy method just speeds up nothing. That's the new one. My very I easy guess. method just speeds up nothing. My very energetic mother just sent us nothing. How about that? <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know. What was it originally? Just made us pizza or something, right? Or I don't know. Yeah, there was a pizza one. That's, what, that's all you... All you remember is the pizza one. Yeah, you know, that's I, the only reason. They got rid of it, so I forgot then it all. I lost weight, started eating less pizza, and then Pluto wasn't a plan anymore. My very educated mother just served us nine pizzas. 
Educated. Very educated. educated. That just served us. Yeah. Nine. Yeah. You could change it. My very educated mother just served us nine. Nine? Yeah, that's not bad. Right? Yeah. Yeah. See? Fixed. Took me a second. And knowing some kind of food that starts with an N. Yeah. See, now you can remember now. Yeah. Now you'll remember the planets. Did you care about Pluto? Yeah. No. You're not being a planet anymore? I mean, it's pretty messed up. There right? were some people that were like upset. But if we count Pluto as a planet, we'd have to count like 80 other objects. Do it. On the Kyber Belt. Just do what, it. 80 planets? Why not? What's the device for that one? Star Wars. My very energetic mother Star just... Wars keeps popping up new planets, right? <laughs> we've, we've had a map of here's the planet. That's a new ones, new ones, new ones. Yeah, we're in a galaxy and stuff. I think it's still officially a dwarf planet, though. Okay, then... So, why can't... So, so because he's a dwarf planet, he's no longer a planet? He yeah. Just, that's uh, unfair to dwarf people. No, it's, it has something to do with the way its orbit works. Its orbit's not the same as all the other planets. To be officially a planet, you have to have a certain type of orbit. I don't know what that means. I mean, you go around and stuff. <laughs> the only other thing I saw that was crazy was that yeah. um, it was like a, a, a image or a video, right? And it's like how everyone sees how like the planets orbit, right? And it's like yeah. here's the sun, and yeah. it showed like everything going around like this, mm-hmm. you know, doing that. And it's like how we really do it, and it showed the sun. There's this ball of gas and flames that's flying yeah, through the galaxy. Flying through the galaxy. And then all of our planets going, yeah, yeah, yeah. like yeah. flying behind it. Yeah, it's all insane. And I'm like, it's that's all, so it's, much scarier. It's so scary. <laughs> that's exactly what it is. Like, what if we just fly off? Yeah. And like, sometimes the sun's just like, oh, shit, drop yeah. that one, you know? Our, yeah, our galaxy's spinning around a massive black hole in the middle of it. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. We're yeah. going to we're gonna collide. We are colliding into the Andromeda galaxy. Yeah. It's insane. Like, the sun's going to hit something. Yeah. But it's probably going to eat it. Yeah. But, like, what if, like, we just, you know, like, one day you're just like, fuck, where'd Jupiter go? You know? Right. Just, just kept going. You know you could do time lapses and, you know, see, like, you know, days just like that, like in the sky. Like, you ever see, think about doing that for, like, a person? And it's just like food, and you're shitting and you're like, until you die. The time lapse, or like shedding skin and hair, and you're just like, like you're eating and shitting, and your shit's just falling off every part of your body at the same time. How do you get that? Like a time lapse. Yeah, but like you just have like a camera from the same distance of the human. It's like a metaphorical camera that yeah, like does a, a lifetime. No, like, I want we like guys. I want to do this. Can do you want a lifetime in 10 seconds? Okay, yeah. we can't do that one. Never mind. That's going to be tough. Yeah. I just like, I want to see someone go, oh, yeah. Why do you want to see it? Just imagine yeah. it. Use it in your mind's eye. Get in the Dreamatorium. Dreamatorium. It was fun. It was interesting. Yeah. I like that. I want to know what Dance Pants is. Dance Pants. He makes it in 2019. What did Donald Glover do in 2019? Was that the, uh, this is America. Was that in 2019? Or was that older? I can't remember now. What Donald, Donald Glover did in. Yeah. Childish Gambino. That's kind of Dance Pants. Because at one point he's he was in The Lion King. Only, yeah, he was such a trip. Donald Glover presents a TV mini miniseries. That could be it. That's Dance Pantsy. I don't think he did Dance Pants. He danced in his pants, and this is America. See right there. <laughs> he's <laughs> dancing in only his pants. You're right. All right, you got me. What happened to Carson Daly? Do you remember Carson Daly? I remember Eminem singing about him and Fred Durst. Yeah. Carson right? Daly hosted. Uh, Oh, it's MTV. What was the show? It was like the top ten music videos. Should have been called the Daily Show. It should have been, but it wasn't. It would have been before the Daily Show. Yeah, I think it would probably have been. right. Yeah, that's a long time ago. MTV. It's not like it's not TLC, but it was something like that. Then he had a show like after Conan for a long time on NBC. Hmm. It'd be like Jay Leno and then Conan and then Carson Daly for some reason. I never said it for that. We did overestimate his capabilities. Sit next to Carson Daly and Fred Durst. I wonder what Carson Daly's doing right now. Man, I hope he's not a Broadway fan. He's like, what? What the hell, guys? I don't know what he does. (laughs) What does Carson Daly do? I know of him. Yeah. But I didn't really watch a lot of MTV. I know this is judgy, but I always felt like he was the most unhyped presenter I've ever seen. Unhyped presenter? Yeah, he never got me excited to see something. (laughs) Who does get you excited? I don't know. DJ Elliott? Yeah. Totally does. They help, there's, a, there's a group like of people DJ that Elliot. understand what that meant. There is, and we love you. Uh, Barmageddon. Huh? He was in. He's in a show called Barmageddon. Barmageddon? It came out in 2022 for nine episodes. All right. Um, you know, back in the day when you're like, man, I got a TV show. I got something. But now, 
There's TV shows that have less views than us. <laughs> you know? One like TV TV. Sure. <laughs> he is not in a lot. No. He was a voice of a speedy speedboat mm-hmm. in Doc McStuffins. Yeah. Poor guy. Poor guy. Also, poor guy to Troy who didn't un- understand Inception. There was too many layers for him. Feel bad. I love his like spiral of yeah. truth serum it was moment. great. Fantastic. It was really good. Yeah. I also enjoyed Abed's like performance of like the others me too you know? i kind of wish they didn't do the like the actually see the actors thing. i think i kind of like, i thought it would have been like a thousand times better if they just had the actor do the impressions yeah maybe because like abed starting off as jeff like i was like is he jeff yeah and then he turned into jeff yeah, no. you know I, um, I, I yeah n- nothing you know of course i love all of our characters but i thought this was the perfect opportunity to have that actor just do everybody yeah <laughs> maybe it's i don't know maybe how comfortable he is with each one but i don't know maybe yeah. he'd be okay I did like the, uh, even though it was in the, we're seeing the actors themselves, Mm -hmm. you saw like this weird, like, digital version of Abed switch between them, and then it would be Abed's voice, and then their voice. Yeah, because he plays all the characters, yeah, I get you. I thought that was kind of cool. I like that. The kiss was disturbing. Uh, 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 Yeah, he was. was I mean, I guess, like, how do you kiss yourself when you're having to pretend to be two people, right? Because, like, you're going to be like, uh, 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 and you're going to come over here and be like, uh, 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 and it's like, you can't be both people. True. But we saw both people. That's what made it awkward. I was disturbed, but probably not as disturbed as a lot of people watching each of us with our hands in our pockets trying to reach our balls. Guys, thank you very much for watching this episode of Community. We hope that you enjoyed the video, the reaction, the discussion, all of that, and in between, make, make sure you come back next week for more community right here on Blind Wave every Wednesday until we finish.